Right, seventh gym badge time. A little bit different this one. Just got into the town and the shutter's closed so no one else can enter the town. I've snuck in through a back route. And uh, it's kind of just thrown me straight into the gym battle. Uh, this, this dude here made me change into my gear so it, it's not the conventional gym or stadium setup we've seen so far. Which is kind of cool. I'm guessing I have to fight all these yell members before I get to the gym leader. All I know is the gym leader is called Piers and he uses dark type Pokemon. And I do not think I have anything to counter that. As always, <laughs> I have a terrible team. They're doing the job though. We're brute forcing, brute forcing it through. So I shouldn't really complain too much. Mm. I've swapped out... Um, who did I swap out? I swapped out Corvin Knight though. And I've... No, no, sorry. I've swapped out Dreadnought. And I've put in Waylord. Because I love Waylord. And... I'm kind of curious to see how awesome he looks when he's Dynamaxed. Because he's massive anyway. Endeavor. Maybe. I don't know what Endeavor is. Cuts down the target's HP equal to the user's HP. No, I don't want that. I don't want that. So I'm, I'm pretty confident that Waylord will be my water Pokemon until the end of the game now. I like Waylord. I need to teach him some decent water moves, so currently I think he's just got Dive. I need Hydro Pump. Get out of my way, you guys. Yeah, I think this might just be a long track now to the to the gym leader, fighting dudes on the way, but then there's no gym challenge. I, I know of it. Thank you. Oh, Mr. Mine. Okay. Oh. <laughs> I'm completely stumped. Like, how do I get through a light barrier made by Mr. Mime? I hope these guys are using Mr. Mime. I haven't, that's the first Mr. Mime I've seen in this game. I love that, uh, that Fox Pokemon's little mustache. I love how, in general, like, pretty much all the Pokemon in this game that are new. They've got like a weird kind of English gentleman or lady kind of twist to them. Um, like tea and cake. Everything's got like mustaches. Obviously Farfetch'd is now a Sir. He's a knight. The Raven Pokemon, like Edgar Allan Poe. There's a lot of uh, a lot of British and English references going on. And it makes sense because that's where it's set. But even just the mustache. Kind of uh, archetypally gentleman. You gonna let me through, Mr. Mime? Yeah, Barry, Barry. Off you go. Thank you very much, sir. Thanks for the hint. No, I really wasn't sure what way to go. So many options. You gonna fight me from the windows? Oh my god. This bit reminds me a little bit of Streets of Rage, apart from I'm not obviously doing any fighting. Fighting, fighting. Just the side scroll in and the way these characters look is very Streets of Rage. Obviously, these guys are very like. They're punks, aren't they? English punks. I like this little guy. He's a punk as well, a little punk Pokemon. It's like holding up his trousers, which I find a little bit strange. I really can't wait to get to the um, Dragon Gym. I think that would be a real challenge. I don't. Everything else I've been able to brute force past. I don't know if I'm going to be able to do that at the Dragon Gym. I haven't really built to counter any Dragon types. And traditionally, I usually have a pretty hard time when I get to the Dragon type Pokemon. Um, I find with most Pokemon games, once you've got a Pokemon like your starter, once your starter gets to a certain level, you can just brute force with basically one move and it will pretty much clean house. Um, yeah, look, level 54. Most of my party is about to break into 50, which is pretty cool. I can't remember kind of what level I usually am when I get to like the league. I think I tend to have Pokemon floating around the 65, maybe 70 um, mark, but I'm really not sure. So I didn't complete um, Pokemon Let's Go. I bought a copy of Pokemon Let's Go, Let's Go Pikachu, but I didn't go all the way through it. Um, don't know why, I just, I just lost interest. The 
HP of your Pokemon not looking so good? It's looking pretty good. You've barely touched me. I don't think you have touched me. Yeah, okay. Whatever you say. Weevil. It's ice type. I should be able to destroy that. Ice dark? Or is it steel? I don't know. Whoa, why'd you get to go first? I knew it had ice moves. Beat that drum. Just not a challenge at this point. I need my Waylord to catch up. Might have to go and do some Dynamax battles and get some of the... Um, you get like little XP shards and you can give them to your Pokemon to just level them up without battling. I might have to grab a bunch of those and give them to Waylord just to kind of bring him back in line with everyone else. That's just not the easiest way to get around, is it really? Back flipping all over the place. How long is this? Oh. I'm at the end. Going in here, I guess. Oh, this is a lot of Team Yell. Pincer attack. Oh no. Oh he's not got his he's not got his makeup on. <laughs> oh he looks He's still got a little bit of eyeliner. It's not the end of the world. Who have I got in my top two slots? The grass boys. Use it on him. Um, yeah, let's do that. You can use the um, I can't remember, brutal swing um, or brutal strike. The far fetch move is is really good, but it will hit your um, it will hit your ally Pokemon as well. It's like the trade off. Come on, Waylord. God, that was easy. Have these guys got any more Pokemon, or is that it? Oh, guys, come on. This is the seventh gym. This is the easiest so far. Our gym leader's up next. Yeah, it's genuinely the easiest so far. No gym challenge as well. No, like, um, little puzzly kind of mini game type thing beforehand. Which is a bit of a shame, actually. I've really enjoyed those. Um, let's just make sure he's fighting fit. And do I have... Done. Ready to rock and or roll. Shut your gob. That's how all of us English people speak. Can I just go and fight the gym leader now? These guys are like uh, fanatics for this character, this Marnie character. They only want her to win the, the, the cup, the Pokemon League. So they're just trying to do everything to kind of get in, get in everyone else's way. They're not, they're like, they're kind of like a Team Rocket equivalent, I guess, but they're not inherently evil. There isn't really a bad guy in this game, I don't think. There usually is, but there, there isn't a Rocket or a Team whatever. Well, Team Yell, but they're not bad. Just a bit annoying. Go on in and face the gym leader. Oh, it's like a backyard brawl. I'm going in. That's cool. Fighting him in like a playground kind of thing. Oh. He's, uh... He sure is something. It sounds like the... It sounds like his like, fans are booing him, not cheering. Finally here. See, I'm I'm really not a great gym leader. What? We can't even Dynamax our Pokemon. Oh. Okay. It's basic one-on-one. -on -one. No Dynamax in. 
He's got some fantastic hair. And he's a very cool microphone as well. Get ready for a mosh pit. Whatever you say, sir. Let's go, Piers. You guys love that Pokemon. Like, you've always gone. It's because he's got the punk haircut. I get it, but... Ah. Intimidate. Oh no, my attack went down a little bit. Won't stop me from destroying you. Oh, I flinched. Get out of here, Scrafty. Oh. Okay. Okay. Putting up a little bit of a fight. I think this thing must have another evolved form. It looks like a secondary... Secondary evolution. First evolution, sorry. You can always tell when it's like the middle evolution. They just look a certain way. Not always correct about that, but... They tend to look kind of teenage, like there's going to be another thing coming. Uh, I didn't even, didn't even read who's coming next. It was Malamar. Oh, what is that? Is that like a squid? Is it a water type? I hope it is, because this will destroy it. It looks like a squid. Eh, it's fine. Its speed went up because I hit it. That's a cool looking Pokemon. I want one of them. Yeah, I really want one of them. Oh. Hanging on in there. Isn't Malamar a place? Could be wrong. I think I'm wrong. Malamar. No, it's like a bar, like a chocolate bar or food. Oh dear, he killed me. I'm certain a Malamar is like a something you can eat. Come on, Pikachu. The only Pokemon that can actually talk properly in this entire game. And Eevee. Oh, you need to die real quick. You're messing me up. Thank you very much. Obstagoon. Oh, this is the um, Gene Simmons Pokemon, I think. I think. All the Zigzagoon, Linoon family look like Gene Simmons now, but I think this is the one that's like full on. Yeah, that is just awesome. Ah, I love that. I love that so much. Obstruct. Is that going to stop me from hitting him? Yeah, there we go. I need uh, Surfetched, really. His brick, bait, uh, brick Break can smash through that, I think. Oh, that's alright. He's let his guard down. He's very extravagant, this guy. He's doing a lot of extra stuff. Oh, Throat Chop. Oh. It's the last place you want to get chopped. Right, I might use this. I'll try and hit him one more time, and then I might use this this chance to um, bring back my Rillaboom. Heal him. Because this dude's just going to chop away at my... Oh, no, I'll keep going, actually. I think I'll probably take him down. That's such a cool design for a Pokemon. And very obviously inspired by Kiss and Gene Simmons. I don't know if they ever said that it 100% was. <gasps> I know that he kind of like chimed in and responded to the fact that this Pokemon looks like him. But I don't think they ever turned around and said, yeah, it's inspired by... It's obviously inspired by Kiss, but... Who knows? 
Whoa, get in nine tails. Scum tank. Yeah, I'm gonna have to switch to. She's Corvin Eye for a bit and then I'll heal up Rillaboom. Don't do Encores. Okay, that's good. One more Pokemon then. And then I'm done with you. Everyone's going to stink, but who cares? Sucker Punch and Toxic at the same time. Hope not. Okay, there's Sucker Punch. I'm guessing he's going to use Toxic next time. This guy's like signposting and advertising the moves he's going to do before he doesn't. Oh, Screech. Okay, maybe he's not. Come on. Oh, you cheeky. Oh, dear. Let's see if I can get in there before he finishes me off. No, he's going to finish me off. Oh, damn it. I just need someone to get in there and hit him. Let's see if I can get Thunder in there real quick to finish this off. Yeah, you're quicker. You! Oh, how annoying. Damn it. Oh, Pikachu, I'm sorry. I just need you to, to, to land one thunder attack. And this is over. In theory. Yes. Oh, seventh gym done. Decent levels up there as well. Oh, that one was a little bit different, a little bit straightforward. Kind of just a normal old school gym. Quite nice. Getting more and more money every time I win one of these. Seven grand. Some of the clothing items in this game cost loads, like 80 grand for a jumper or a pair of trousers. Uh, come on, hand it over. Thank you very much, sir. A little, little handshake. Slips me a dark badge at the same time. And that fills that gap nicely. Oh, that next badge is massive. I will cry, and I'm sorry. You can now catch Pokemon up to level 55. Ooh. I don't want to wear that dark uniform. It's not my style. Oh, is it his little sister? That's cool. Aww. I want you to take over the gym. Oh, that's cool. Big fat no! Oh my god. When I end up becoming champion, I won't be able to be a gym leader. That's a good point. You won't be champion though, because I'm going to be champion. So, you probably should have took that job. Clear off for a bit. No worries, no dramas. I'm out of here. Thank you very much. Snarl. I'll never use that. Oh my god, what was that? Trouble over on Route 9. It's so bad, even the champions come to sort things out. Whoa! I better go check that out. Is it making me do it? Like, I have no choice. I'm just sprinting my way there. Kaboom! What's happening? I've got a handle on this. Whoever's making that noise, I'll see to it. Only gym badge left is the one you'll get from the Dragon Gym's leader, Raihan. That is it. I'm going to go and get it. What's happening? Kaboom. There's something in that tunnel. 
Hmm. Well, I'm going to go and check that out. Uh, but for now, until next time, take care. That's badge number seven in the bank.